So another non-binary but human question, why change my name? So a few people have asked me this actually in different ways, particularly because the name I was given when I was born, Alison, had quite a few gender neutral shortened abbreviations, particularly Al. And there definitely were people in my life that used Al, there were people that used Ali, there was people that used Alison. I'm pretty sure I've had some other um, more inappropriate nicknames over my time. Look, for me, I absolutely didn't feel comfortable with that name. And there was something that was just empowering. And I'd almost reverse the question and say, why not choose your name? It is often something that we are given at birth before our personalities are really developed, before we can really define ourselves and the people that we are. For me, I think it was part of that journey. It wasn't just about having that gender neutral name that couldn't be used as a longer, very feminine version of Alison. It was about me feeling empowered to say, actually, I don't like that name and I want to be able when people speak to me to respond and feel good when I hear my name. And I've got to be honest, bloody hell, I feel amazing since I changed it to Rowan or Ro. Every now and again, still, when people use um, that new name, I get a little bit of a, do you know, a flutter or a, a happy beat. So look, I appreciate it won't be the step that everybody in that non-binary space takes. Some of them will feel comfortable and not want to make that change. Others just maybe aren't ready and they'll do it further down the line. But for me, Alison was never a name that kind of fit. Ro, or as they've started calling me at Archery now, Ro Ro, definitely works.